thank you for joining us here this morning. Let's begin the broadcast with big news that we're tracking as far as the Akhnur terror attack is concerned. Second terrorist has been gunned down is the latest that we are picking up. US made M4 assault rifle that has been recovered. In fact, in battle cordon and search operations continue and the firefight with third terrorist continues. Yavar, my colleague, joins us for more inputs on that. Yavar, what do we know so far? Uh, well, as of now, two militants have been utilized in the early morning. One more militant has been killed. Now, the tall march to two yesterday, one more one militant was utilized. They have been given the understanding that the U.S. made and four guard and rifles have been uh, recovered from the positions. And the army has also lost uh, one of its assault, uh, you know, dog. And uh, so as to speak, the reinforcements have impressed the service. Uh, now, it's been close to the 24 hours of this operation right here, following the militants try to strike on the army ambulance in the Akhmir. The militants tried to, you know, went into the jungle. However, cornered by the security forces, and this operation was right on. Uh, the priority for the security forces is to ensure that there will be no casualty from uh, the security forces side, so as the damage to the civilian population. That's why this operation is taking a bit of a more time. Uh, given the understanding of the facts uh, that uh, the security forces have pressed on the latest uh, weaponries and uh, the sophisticated vehicles, armored vehicles, to flush out these militants. We have been also given the understanding by the sources that one more militant is trapped in the area. Probably. Uh, the search operation is still intact in the area. Uh, probably this uh, group uh, is a foreigners group uh, for the identity and uh, the affiliation. The security force are going to come up with the details of it now. Back to Right, yeah, well, in fact, as you pointed out, and more details to emerge, we're also given to understand seizures have been made in the form of the rifles that have been uh, seized at the moment. What do we know on that front? Well, it's the M4 car the rifle that have been recovered from the militants. And uh, this has become a routine for the militants to use these rifles in the past, be it in the Kashmir or in the Jumu. And then the encounter takes place, the militants provide more probably and you know, mostly from the foreigners group, but they use this M4 rifle. This has become a routine, but the security forces are taking up as a challenge. And the militants, they are trying to show their presence uh, from, you know, every nook and corner of the Kashmir Valley. So in the Jumu, that's why we are witnessing that uh, the peaceful areas are being targeted in the Kashmir. Valley and in Jumu, the militants also try to show their presence. So somewhere the security was already in the alert mode, and uh, this has eventually led uh, the file of uh, the you know, militant attack in the uh, yesterday. But yes, uh, the rifle that were recovered from these militants uh, is the M4, which has been usually you know, recovered from the militants uh, in the various encounters that took place uh, in the past in both the regions, that's the Jumu as well as in the Kashmir Valley. Right, yeah, well, thank you for getting us the latest as far as what we're given to understand and more details that are emerging uh, at the moment. But for now, we're going to have to leave it at that. We're now